Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from Our Half Acre Homestead, and I've been working on this one in my head for a couple of days. Let's make some drums for our tree. Now, I, as usual, I have stuff all over the table because you know what? You know what gets my imagination going? Unlimited craft supplies. <laughs> So if I see, and I don't, this is by no means all of my crafting supplies. I just wish I had more time to craft. But we are going to make the most of today since Papa is in the garage working on the car. Uh, you can use wrapping paper, but you're going to want some of this wonderful sparkly rope stuff. So what I did was, now I don't need... An ornament drum I really don't but I'll tell you something I have lots of them but I really like how simply they were made so I have a paper towel roll and I'm just going to measure my drum you see where I'm going with this folks now this is just that plastic velvet ribbon but it will do the job. Now what I have here, these are paper discs, and all I did was take some of these small muffin papers and I ironed them out. Yes, folks, not only should you have an iron for quilting, you should have one for crafting. So let's measure off our drum covering. Okay, that'll work perfect. Now what I wanna do is I wanna make the top of the drum and what I'm going to do is I thought of pushing one of these muffin papers up through to make the surface of the drum, but it quite didn't quite look right. Start with a couple of dabs of glue around the edge. How about that? Let's just pop this buddy down over here. See, now we have a little drum top. Now we're going to put one on the bottom. Try and keep it centered and then just form it down over and hope like heck you hit the glue. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this ribbon around it to hold that top and bottom in place. I got paper cups all over the place here. So let's just start right here and I'm just going to put Now you can use Lee Page's, you know, um, kid glue if you want. This is pretty kid friendly. And I am just going to stretch and roll all the way until I get to the other side. Give it a snip. Put some glue on here like that. Maybe I should have put it on the other side. Yes, I just burnt my fingers. You want it as tight as you possibly can get it without crushing, without crushing your cylinder. Okay, now let's get this fancy gold rope here into place. This might take a little more patience. But make sure you get it as close to the edge somebody said please no more cork ornaments okay except I'm going to be using a cork in my angel tree topper now you don't want it above the edge okay but kind of plant figure out where you're going to place the next one and just kind of hold it there like that and the next one's going to be here you got to kind of eyeball it like that can you folks see what i'm doing here? okay this guy's going to be a little bit crooked because well i didn't uh measure but that's okay your kids aren't going to measure either is it starting to look like a drum folks 
Yes, it's bird o'clock. Okay. Now, let's play with our rickrack. Yes, folks, somebody corrected me when I said this gold sparkly stuff. Now, we're going to start where we started. And we're going to take the end, if I can find it, of our rickrack. There's my other clock. And every once in a while, try not to burn your fingers, we're going to put a little dab of glue. And we're going to continue on around. Oh, my goodness. Try and hide your rope. This is why you don't want the rope sticking above. But I'm pretty sure no one's really going to notice. A little dab of glue right there. And back to the beginning. Now, because this is a paper top and I don't want to put... A hook through it. I'm just going to take a little bit of this beautiful rope because remember the little drummer boy he wore it on a on a thing around his neck. Now if I only had some tiny drumsticks and there it is our little drum. Come they told me pum pum pum. I'm pretty proud of that. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our half acre homestead saying homemade ornaments are the best and you know what especially when they're simple enough for your kids to do take care god bless you.